In October 2017, the City and County of Denver announced its groundbreaking Vision Zero plan to address a crash rate more than double peer cities such as Seattle and Minneapolis, as well as an increase in fatalities despite previous investments designed to create a safer transportation system. Since its launch, Vision Zero has attracted international recognition for its approach to traffic-related injuries and deaths as unacceptable and preventable. Vision Zero has already informed citywide improvements and is transforming transportation and public health in Denver and the entire region. Vision Zero transcends traditional approaches to traffic safety. Rather than assuming human behavior will change, Denver leaders are designing a transportation system that is more forgiving. The city's strategy is built on data, such as analyzing traffic crashes involving all forms of travel and the identification of areas where the most severe crashes occur. Additionally, it includes mapping communities with high concentrations of seniors, schools, community centers, and people with disabilities, as well as areas with low rates of car ownership. The city's analysis revealed that nearly 50% of Denver's traffic fatalities occur on just 5% of the city's streets. Significant public outreach has informed Vision Zero throughout its development. The Vision Zero Coalition includes Denver's leading mobility nonprofit organizations, business improvement districts, and the business community. Relationships within the coalition lend community perspectives, flexibility, resourcefulness, and agility to Vision Zero implementation. Denver's Vision Zero plan will not only make for safer travel for residents, commuters, and visitors traveling in and around the city and county of Denver, but its many elements and comprehensive approach are replicable and may inform similar plans in communities throughout our region and beyond. The safety of our transportation system is essential to the region's Metro Vision Plan and Vision Zero is a stellar model of how our communities will ensure the safety of drivers, transit riders, bicyclists, and pedestrians alike.